on there. Sorry, math teachers. Uh, anyway, uh, that would give us negative uh, 4.0528x on the uh, left side equals some negative number here because we have 35.9826 minus 39.0095 which is negative 3.0269. Now we need to divide both sides by this negative number, negative 4.0528 to get the x by itself, negative 4.0528. So that gives us a positive number, so that means the x is equal to, well, let's punch that in, negative 3.0269 divided by uh, negative 4.0528 and you end up getting the following. You end up getting x is equal to 0 0.7468 uh, six, what is that? I'm trying to look at the calculator. 7468663 Anyway, we need this as a percentage. Um, looking at this as far as sig figs, uh, you need to keep probably four digits. <coughs> so uh, that would be uh, x would be uh, 74 point because the decimal will be there 69 percent. Now we need to think about this number that we wrote down. That uh, sorry, I we'll have to use another sheet of paper. That a uh, seventy-four point six nine percent will be for which one of these two in the beginning? Is it going to be for MI thirty-five? Is it going to be for MI thirty-nine? It's actually going to be for MI thirty-five because that's the one we put the X in. Okay, so this seventy-four point six nine percent will be for uh, the uh, thirty-five MI. Okay, now all you have to do is to get the other one. Uh, for the MI 39 is just basically subtract that from 100. So all you do is you go uh, 100 minus the 74.69 percent. So we do that. <laughs> end up getting uh, zero. Oh, excuse me. End up getting 0 0.2531 uh, 33636 uh, MI on the 39. So basically looking at that as percentages, that's 25.31% uh, for the uh, 39 MI. Okay, So there's our two percentages, the one for MI 39 and the one for MI 35. Alright guys, I hope this helps. Just watch it over and over and over.